Welcome to the world's biggest physics event. We're here in sunny Anaheim for the first ever Global Physics Summit. Stand by for a packed series of APS TV. This is APS TV. Physics is a truly global effort. As long as there are new discoveries to make and new problems to solve, the physics community will come together, share, learn and chat to colleagues at events just like this one. This community is so vibrant and broad, but it takes an event like this to really feel the scope of what people are doing in physics today. I'm so excited to be here to understand what's happening in labs big and small all over the world. As the meeting kicks off and the APS TV's cameras roll, let's see what's coming up for you today. It's time to get to know the Global Physics Summit campus. We'll meet with some of the team behind the scientific programme for a tour of all the venues that make up this year's event. The particle physics side, which we don't usually get to interact with from the March meeting side, um, we actually have a lot of inter interaction with them, especially when it comes to the ideas of quantum mechanics. And just to remember that we're all in this together, that we're all doing physics together. And we'll catch up with APS President John Doyle and Jonathan Bagger to look at the role physics and the APS are playing in the world today. We have to maintain the health of physics and science. We need to reach out to government officials and explain how science fits in uh, to society, the development of the economy, the defense of the country. These are very important subjects and uh, it's a time to renew our message. 